Hi everyone, this is my channel, Amanda Random, and this is Amanda, and I have a cold, so I sound like a gruff, mean, old Grinch. So, with that being said, this mean old Grinch went Christmas shopping, and I stumbled upon this cute little thrift store, and, well, hello, Zoe. And, uh, I'm gonna try to talk so that you guys can understand me. If you can't, I'm sorry. But anyway... I found so many cool things at this thrift store, and I want to show you guys what some of them are. Um, I found this cute little stamp with the little Asian girl or geisha girl. Um, I think I only paid a, less than a dollar for this because it was on sale. <clears throat> so I found all kinds of artsy stuff at this um, thrift store, and it's so cool. So I found this. And then I found this cute little book. And this must have been from Goodwill but ended up at the thrift store. I don't know. But um, I only paid, I think, 99 cents for this. And it's really cute. Um, opens up. And it's just all pink in little paper. And then it closes. So I found that there. Kitty! Oh! Did you guys see that? She's so mean. And then I found this book, and this is a travel journal, it says. My cat just turned my printer on. Yeah, this must have also come from Goodwill, but I did find it at this other place. So, um, you open it. She's printing something. What is going on here? You open it up, and it's just this really cool, um, when you take this off, there's a little pocket back here. And then it's all lined paper, and I believe there's a pocket right here in the front. So I thought that was super cool. And like I said, I think I paid also 99 cents for this. And you can tell size here. But I thought those were awesome scores for only 99 cents. Um, and I got myself, my favorite author is Nora Roberts. And I got The Witness. Um, and I paid, I think... 50 cents for this book seriously uh let's see let's see then i found this this was really cute it opens up and it is a photo pocket um book sack i don't know but it's cool and i like it and i don't know what i'm gonna do with it but i'm gonna make some kind of funky book or maybe wrap my wrap my thing with it i don't know what i'm gonna do but i'm gonna do something cool so that's stop printing stuff okay I gotta pause this because my cat is like seriously wasting all my printing paper all right sorry about that I'm back and now Zoe's gonna go wreck something else on my desk um where did we leave off Nora Roberts book and I also found this is like a fabric and it just reminded me of you know some type of Japanese style book and it's so cute and it's just another lined paper book um, but I thought it was really I think this one I only paid 50 cents for too like come on seriously um, and I found I'm not gonna get it off of here now but I found this black portfolio book that I thought was really cool and it's got a guy on the front and it actually looks like he's doing a fucking dab um but yeah seriously it looks like he's dabbing um and it opens up and I was like oh cool blue paper then I realized it's all black paper it's so awesome so I can use some of my Zoe get out I can use some of my really cool gel pens and stuff on this and I thought that was really cool and it's like a a thicker cover. Now she turned something else on. She turned on my selfie printer back here. Look what she just did. It's away. Oh. Good Lord in heaven. My son needs to show y'all something quick. That is the dab, in case all of you were wondering what I was talking about. That was the dab. He officially just dabbed for you guys. Um, moving on, I got this. This was super cute. I was like, oh, this is awesome. Look at, 
Oh my god, I'm gonna put this all over. All over my Fobonichi. I'm gonna stamp it everywhere. Um, these are cool. These are huge jumbo playing cards. And Joey, Zoe, get. And um, I have an awesome idea I want to do with these because I watch a, a girl on, a lady on Facebook, and she is making this awesome Alice in Wonderland stuff out of jumbo playing cards. And I'll see if I can link her um, thing below if you want to check it out. But she makes these cute little... I don't even want to ruin it. Just go check out her channel. I will definitely try and link it. Um, but that's what I have an idea to do with these. I want to make them into like a book. Um, I found this Deco Art Crafters acrylic paint. And it's yellow gold. So I don't know if you can see that. But it's really like bright kind of glittery goldy looking. So yeah. Um, <coughs> excuse me, I also found these, and one is going to go on the back of my cell phone, because I love skulls, I love them, so I picked that up, how this ended up in my cart, I don't know, I think my daughter did put it in there, but apparently it's, I'm now the proud owner of a bottle stamp, so, yeah. Google. Um, I found this is just a glue pen um, and it's archival so I don't know this looks like it might work really cool it says it dries clear and I only paid a dollar fifty for this and it's a forever in time brand paper craft collection I don't know but looks pretty cool it's got the precision tip so if you're doing some of that tricky gluing, um, I also found these, and this is also this Forever in Time, Pop Dot Adhesives for cards and card making and just anything you want to kind of pop off some, anything you're making, make it look a little 3D. And there's, how many does it, 528 pieces. So for $1.50, hells to the yeah. Um... I have an addiction to notebooks, so I picked up this, and it's got amazingly cute little feathers, and it just flips open and closed, and I see something back here. Oh, it must hold a pen. What? I got gypped. I got gypped, man. I didn't get a pen. <laughs> it was only a dollar. But that's pretty cool now that I know what it does. Um, I found this awesome brick looking stencil, which I cannot wait to play with with some of my inks and backgrounds in my art journal. I also found double sided tape, which is how much did we say was in here? I don't remember, I don't remember, but there's enough and. It's awesome. And this is that forever in time again. And I was so happy I found this store. Usually these like thrifty stores don't have much of this art stuff in around my area. <coughs> Excuse me. And when I found this, I was I was geeking out. I couldn't help it. Now this is a card and envelope set. There it's six set. So you get six cards, six envelopes. A dollar fifty. Look at this. Pre-made already. Card stock. Can you imagine what you could do with those? Um, and then I found card stock tab stickers. So what you do is you take these and you pinch them on the side of your paper and then you have your own little tab. And I'm gonna use those in my journal. And I found these and I couldn't resist because I thought how cute would this look if I put a black on here and then put these on top of the black and made really cute cards. And they're handmade stickers. So, yeah. Doable. These, I'm going to back up here just to kind of even let go. Show you. Check all the sides. Now, these top edges can be used if you want to do like a scallop drawing in your paper. I got all these different circles. Little circles, big circles. Awesome stencil. Check out this side. Now here's a different 
edging if you want to put it in your journal or whatever you're doing and all different size hearts so if you don't have like a die cutter machine or something there you go trace this pop it out there you go um now at this store they have new stuff and used stuff so this was used but it's um dozens of dots the terrific stamps set with exclusive inks and this one's smoky plum and this one is literally these colors um it's like a teal a purple and fades to pink and i got these for less the goodwill sticker says 199 but where i got them from i think i paid like 75 cents for that and then last but not least i found paper pizzazz sheets and it's the big cutouts which I started flipping through here and realized you just cut these out how many cute freaking things could you come up with to put in your journals in your junk journals in your art journal in your Fobonichis um you can make so many cute things with this stuff so this was a definite and I paid less than a buck yeah so I had to share my thrift store um, stuff with you guys because I just wanted to and because I can. So, thank you for watching. It's almost Christmas. Stay safe out there, everyone. And I will be back soon. Much love to you all. Thanks for watching.